We are live. Hi, everyone. This is Wally. And then that <clears throat> Supreme Gecko. And we're here to do day number two of the 12 Supreme Days of Christmas. If you followed the event so far, it has been mind blowing on day one how much, how many gifts we've given away. And incredible, all the donors that have given so much to this event. So I put everything into my spreadsheet and I broke it down by gifts and I thought I was over 200. Well, I'm at 220 gifts this year and we're over. Anybody, how much are we over for value? And value, again, for this event isn't the measuring, isn't the main thing. It's the only measurement I really have to say, are we doing better than last year or not? It's always hard to balance that. I'd like to see participation numbers, but we do this across the board. So that's kind of a tough measurement. Um, I hope everybody can hear us. Can we get a, a check to make sure that people can hear us? Over 30K, they can hear Over 30,000. They Your can hear us? Sleeping. What's that? Your elf is sleeping. My elf is sleeping. What elf? What elf? I don't know of any elf. <laughs> So follow Somebody my lead here. Follow my lead. Follow, yeah, I haven't seen Minette anything. Minette hasn't looked at the script. She I have no idea. She has Again. no idea at all. So as you know, we always open the show. You guys tolerate this very well. I appreciate it. So let's get it kicked off with a bang. <laughs> On the fifth day of Christmas, my true love gave to me ba -dum -bum -bum. five <laughs> golden rings. Yeah, this. Ba -dum -bum -bum. No, you have to say the next line. Four. Four, four calling birds. Three French hens. Two turtle doves. And a partridge in a pear tree. Did everybody but um, bum, sing? But I'm bum bum. God, we've got to sit. I, I tell you what, on the last day of I Christmas, do not sing. we're going to sing that whole song. You're going to be Bing Crosby. I'm going to be <laughs> David Bowie because that's my favorite. That's my favorite Christmas song. Um, the this is your favorite Christmas song? Not Five Golden Rings, oh. no. A little Drummer Boy. Uh, oh. David Boy joins Bing Crosby, and it's a wonderful, wonderful uh, rendition. We should have music in the background. We should. I'm kind of watching the board here. Who's all... So we have 200 people already in the chat. Who's there's no all... way. I know there's no way that we're going to read off all these names. All right. Go I'll ahead. try a few. I got to see Rob, Jay, Amber, Mantis, Angie... Angie, we saw Christy this weekend. Illinois Valley Geckos, Jen Lee, Lisa, Luna's Shield, Rampage. I think I just saw fly past South uh, Southern Rays Exotics. This is great because he's scrolling. Hi, at Cassandra the same time. Faith. Cassandra Faith, CJ the Sloth, Sanya Frank the Tank. Illinois Valley Valley Geckos, Mackenzie Bowling. We've got bowling leagues. Oh, I, it doesn't right. matter. Yeah, we can say it three or four times. Eli's. It, well, not when you're spinning past it. Ashley. Oh, my gosh. I can't even get to I the can't. end. I, no, can't I can't even get to the end of the, the comments. Michelle, book. Sorry Johnny, about that. Fee Nick. Fica. Nick Elden. Isaac. Holy cow. Welcome, everybody. DEA's here. Fire Andrew. Skinks and more. There's um, a lot of people here. This is so I'm going to talk about the 12 Supreme Days of Christmas very, very quickly because you all have already been involved with the day one and heard my rambling about the 12 Supreme Days <laughs> of Christmas. The, so the, yeah, everybody has, but I'm going to still talk about it just in case somebody is joining for the first time. The 12 Supreme Days of Christmas was started 15 years ago. It's the, on the 11th. I had a uh, year. I've had a little, I had a little bit of a break. Uh, from the, doing the 12 Supreme Days of Christmas, but we started off small with about $200 given to last year, 20000 this year, $30,000. Um, it's a way for us to give back to the community. It's it's a way to hopefully bring this, this reptile community together in a happy kind of ending to the year, ending of 2022. It's a way to acknowledge and support the wonderful, wonderful reptile breeders and reptile supply manufacturers or suppliers out there. Um, so anytime that you see somebody participating, anytime you see a donation, it would be great. Um, we do such a good job of sharing this event, um, the the uh, how to enters and the actual live stream, but go out to a, a, a donor's page and say, thank you for joining the 12 Supreme Days of Christmas. Um, we also have a website for the 12 Supreme Days of Christmas. That's in this video's description. It's all posted all over the place. Um, 
Obviously, you know about the YouTube because you're here, but subscribe to the Supreme Gecko channel. Hit that notification all so you don't miss any of these days. Just kind of looking at my notes here. We have a schedule. At least you have notes. I have notes, that. and I'm not going to share them with you. So we also have a schedule where you can see what's going on. We usually do the live streams Monday, Wednesday, and Friday, and we do the how to enter the day after the live stream. So if we do a live stream on Wednesday where we're giving away day two, Thursday I'll come out with a video showing how or telling how to enter for day three. It's really as simple as that. We try to keep this whole process simple. You're getting tired of this rambling, aren't you? I want to thank Andrew uh, from DEA Exotics for coming up with this method of drawing tonight. And we're going to uh, actually look at that in just a little this bit. This is Andrew's idea? This was Andrew's idea. So, Andrew, if it fails miserably, if it if we get to the very first gift and we can't work it out, it's going to be your fault, buddy. He knows I'm joking. Mm -hmm. um, rules. This is a, another little quick tidbit here. Go ahead, please. Um, trying, but they're going so fast. Public Sorry. service we announcement. 300 people. Excellent, excellent. Public service announcement. Um, check the existing rules on that 12 Supreme Days of Christmas page. Make sure that you are, in fact, I'm going to show it right here. Make sure that you're aware of everything going on. You can go over to the rules page. You can go over to see all the donors. You can click on, and I'm look, actually looking at the editing uh, of this page, so bear with me. You can click on a logo and actually go into the uh, donors, the vendors, and see their information. Um, but you can also see the schedule, all kinds of stuff about this event. I hope that makes sense. And now, super cool, because this was another suggestion. I tell you, this is something that I learned in doing it this year is to listen to people and ask <laughs> for, yeah, exactly. I, I'm not a good delegator, so... You're not Ask, a good listener. I'm not a good listener. <clears throat> um, but we had a great suggestion to add a gallery to uh, the page, the 12 Spring Days of Christmas. Now that we have a web page, we can add things to it, like oh. last year's winners. We can add this year's winners, although I'm late on day one. I apologize. But now we can add this gallery, and I think this is super cool here. And if you click on some of these names, you can go right to their page as well. See that, Nanette? Oh, yeah. Oh, this is yes. Trisha. We went to NARBC <laughs> last year, and it's always some, it's sometimes hard to find in at night because we're just all over the place. So, Trisha and Karen, um, uh, Dark Side Geckos, was, they were looking for us. So, Trisha decided to put on the Where's Wally and Nanette shirt. I thought that was pretty cool. It was funny. It was funny. <laughs> So that's a really nice page. Make sure that you go out there and bookmark that page. We also have the 12 Supreme Days of Christmas Facebook page, 12 SDOC, so you can find us there as well. Um, a new rule. So, again, check the rules. I'm going to get to it real quick. Check the rules, but also a new rule from this year is that if you don't claim your gift after a couple of weeks, we're going to throw it right back into the pool. We just have to keep this moving on and we don't want to get to day 12 and have 463 gifts sitting out there that, <laughs> that we need to go through the whole process again. I'm just kidding. We had, I think we have one unclaimed right now, and that's NH. NH, if you're in oh. the stream right now, N period, H period, and we verify this just in case yeah. Bobby or Cindy message me and it's not NH. But NH, if you're in the stream, uh Catch me on Facebook. Send me a, a, a personal message on Facebook so that we can connect you to your gift. Um, I I really, really, somebody caught it. Um, multiple I, people multiple, have seen Multiple it. people have. I, even seen, named I think it. I've seen three comments so far. They haven't named it. it. They named it. What's the name? I'm not telling you because you didn't let me see the stuff. Oh, okay. I'll, I'll keep going. Um, another thing that I wanted to, <laughs> another thing I wanted to, to mention to everybody is, we had a, a little bit of a difficulty with this uh, giveaway. Uh, I got some good feedback that the rules were really, really super clear, but we had some people that um, were putting two words and, and not the right words and things like that. Really, really watch those words. While it's important, this one, it's going to be super important for some of the other giveaways that we're doing uh, coming up uh, day three through day 12. Finally, the last thing that I have for the really? service announcement is, again, thank you, everyone, for sharing. I really appreciate that. I want to mention, too, that on 
uh, Wally Kern, I usually share posts. I put posts out there and people share them all over. And that helps support this whole event. It gets in front of a lot of people. We have a lot of new people coming in here. And that's what promotes this event. And it also brings in donors and gets us bigger gifts, hopefully. Um, I do have messages. Whenever I do the, the whenever I click on who shared, I always see people, I always thank them with a like. But I always at the end see a privacy note, and I'm trying to find it here on my page, where it says you may not be able to see uh, all of the shares because uh, um, that's not it right there. Um, following, okay. like, yeah. Um, you may not I just saw your sheet. Yeah, yeah. I, I don't know why I'm showing you that sheet. Um, but it always says that there's some that I can't see because of privacy settings. That's on whomever is sharing that. So if you want me to see it, you've got to open that up because in the future we might be able to, we might be pulling names based on those shares. Whomever shares, then that's going to go into a pool and we're going to uh, draw names off of that. So they're really concerned about your elf. He's drunk. He is drunk. He's Isn't that what elves are supposed to do? Isn't don't the they? Elf in the don't they supposed to be naughty? Isn't this the time of the year that they're sleeping? He's he's he had too many waffles. We're supported tonight by. He had too many waffles. He had too many waffles. His well, name, if that were waffles. true, I would be sleeping too right now. I although we had meatloaf tonight, we had waffles last night. No, we did not. Monday. No, we did not. What did we have? We had breakfast. It wasn't waffles. It was breakfast. It's cold enough. Um. No, it was French toast. I want to know who watched. I, I hope everybody watched How to Enter Day 2 and saw, actually went all the way through the video and saw the very end. Um, let me know what you thought of that. Um, it, it's, the I moved. liked, was that the elf move? Did, did it fall down? <laughs> no, it moved. Um, it's waving at him. I, I love movies. I love music. Um, I'm going to do more of those. Uh, probably not tomorrow because I, I have a very tight schedule here in the, the facility. We, for the last two weeks, we've been doing minimal downstairs, you know, feeding. And But I tell you what, we have we put away a bunch of babies the last couple of days. Uh, lots of crusted geckos, a lot of weird geckos. I'm going to show them off on videos. I'm, I've been very lax in doing videos the last couple of weeks, and especially to our members of the Buy Me a Coffee Club. Uh, links in the description if you want to join. And that's all I'm going to say about that. But um, I usually do videos for our members, and I haven't for a couple of months, and I've got to get a video out in the next couple of days on that. But that means that tomorrow is going to be a light day for the 12 Supreme Days of Christmas so that I can kind of catch up a little bit, folks. But um, I'm planning on – go ahead and read some of them. I'm and, just reading. I, okay. I'm not reading them out loud. I'm just reading. Okay. They're going so fast right now. Well, grab a couple and throw them on the screen if you find some good ones, good comments. Anyways, I'm going to do more kind of parodies as it is. I'm not going to do like uh, uh, Al, Weird Al Yankovic kind of things, full music videos, but hopefully I can do more like I did um, in the video uh, on how to enter for day two. I have, a, again, I have a whole lot of fun with that. If you have a movie scene that is, or a song that you think that I could parody that's kind of popular, Send me a note on Facebook, and I'll, I'll take it into consideration. I have a few. Yeah, exactly. Isn't that dangerous? I have a few in mind uh, that I'm going to do. Absolutely. Clarice. No, we are not. Why not? I will not be here. Put the lotion in the basket. I'll leave what? the room. You will not. I will be out of here. We're going to do that. We're going to do we Silence of gone. the Lambs. No, we are that's not. A, that's a done deal. No. Bueller's Day Off, somebody just said I the, just did the Elf is Bueller. running. Oh, you're saying that that's what I did in the... No, um, somebody was just saying it. I could do Ferris Bueller. Um, what was the song that he sang? I don't know. Shake it up, baby. Now. Santa Baby in the Robes. I don't Santa know Baby. I, I don't look anything like Madonna. Didn't Madonna do Silence Santa Baby? Silence of the Elves. Silence, Silence of the Elves. Baby. Oh, my gosh. I'm Write out. that down. I'm out. Write that down. I am out. Oh, man. That will be fun. What's another movie? Oh, we could do, uh, we could do Friday the Thirteenth. Little Shop of Geckos. 
little shop Can of you geckos. Stop? These are great. Send me those because I'm going he to forget is. in they two are. minutes. Send them to me on Facebook. I, all I want for Christmas is a hippopotamus. What so. rhymes with hippopotamus from the reptile world? I don't know. It doesn't We're gonna. Matter. This is gonna be fun, folks. I oh yeah. I'll do this. This is great. Um, risky geckos. Risky geckos. Maybe. Hmm. Oh my gosh. This, this is this is grease. Fun. Grease. Gecko on the show. Can I sing like Danny? No, I don't know. Somebody asked if you had Summer. morning geckos. Summer. <laughs> nah. No. I could hit no. that high note. You can, but I don't want to hear. Um. Somebody asked the if you. Podfather. That's done. That's done. Can I do okay. That? Whoever asked about the banded gecko, send them a private message. Yep. If, <laughs> if you have easier. comments that you're oh, like, Wally, do you have banded geckos? Hey, no way I'm going to catch it in this live stream. It's just too quick. Uh, it's just, I want to. I really do. I want to read every single comment. And generally, I do. The pods book. The pods book. And, um, oh, no. Plocastimus. Right. Somebody said. God, you can yes, send lamp. this to me on Facebook. Oh, yeah. Costumus. Oh, my God. The night Santa went crazy by Weird Al. Love it. Love it. So. Kekos on Elm Street. This is getting bad. <laughs> I mentioned already the gift gallery. And if you have won in any of the past years, I don't care if it's back year one. Karen uh, Skinner Walter sent me a picture from the first year of a temp gun that we had given away. She didn't say what year it was. She was saying I won this in the giveaway several years ago. So I asked her, I, who gave you that? Because I like to give credit and everything. She said, Wally, this was year one. This is this was one of your gifts. Um, and I did that temp gun because temp guns are so, so, so important. I think in what we do downstairs, We I use the temp gun all the time. And that's why I gave it away year one so that other people. You gave people, away your temp gun? I, you know, I probably did. I probably gave that one. I didn't do that. I went to uh, Freight Harbor probably and bought a couple of temp guns. Nightmare before it goes. Somebody wants a Lichiamas for Christmas. So Lichianus? Lichia, they added the like a hippopotamus Lichia to the end of it. Okay. I All can't right. say it now. I lost We're going to get there with some of these. These are great. Jingle, Jingle pods. pods. We could sing that jingle pods, you know. Okay, 2001 of Space Gag. I'll read through these notes. You you can send them to me okay. on Facebook, but I'll read through these right. because these are great, great suggestions. Um, so send me pictures of there's actually a post out there, but you can also send me pictures of past gifts and and let me know uh what vendor gave you. You're that. a mean one, Mr. Gecko. What are you doing? I'm are you just is was that just like a comment or was that a, that's what it says right there? Oh, you're a mean one, you're Mr. Mean Gecko. One. I'm kind of like wanting my hat cocoa and okay. you're still talking and it's like 20 minutes in. So I'm not waiting anymore. So because I yelled at you so bad for doing your hot cocoa, your, what is it? What is the official term? It's a cocoa bomb. Hot cocoa in a cup thing. I don't know what. Okay. It's a cocoa bomb. So because I yelled at you for doing your cocoa bomb before the show the last time, you're I now I had to bring waiting. in a thermal mug. Okay. All right. I'm done with thermal you. Thermal mug. She's done with me. I'm done. I'm not waiting. Okay, you do that, and I'm going to mention that. It's got that. a candy cane in it, too. Well, you can take the candy cane away. I'll, I'll just take the chocolate stuff. Ooh, Shariba. Walking in a gecko wonderland. These are just fantastic ideas. Really I love this. This is so fun. Okay, while you're doing that, put your cocoa bomb thing, E. Put your cocoa bomb on the table because we have something but, special to open. But Go ahead, take a sip of uh, it's too hot. It's got to melt. Oh, that looked good. Okay, grab the grab the box, and I'm just going to take a sip of this. That's like super duper hot, and it's peppermint, and you don't like peppermint. The box. This box? That's a good $5 shake. What movie? I know. What's in the box? What's in the box? Everything's movies, folks. It okay, is. so this is from Jason Smith uh, from Magic Bug Barn, who is one of our donors. Bug Barn? Magic Bug Barn. Not just Bug Barn. This is Magic so I'm Bug Barn. So opening a bug. So you're opening a bug. Uh, he said that he's going to send me 4,683 mantises. Um, no, he's not. Where's my cocoa bomb? Well, come over and get one, Josh. 
come over and get one, buddy. Um, so he mentioned that he was going to send me a gift. So it's like, you guys don't have to do this. this we've had gifts come in. Um, Veronica sent us a beautiful painting. Um, Emily Langwell sent over a nice gift package. And all this noise is certainly have, re wreaking havoc on our mic. I apologize. Um, what's in the box? Thank you, Mantis guy. Somebody knows. Somebody has to repeat it. Thank you for everything. I should do you... a takeoff on that. Like getting a gecko in, in the mail. Like, Am I what? opening this or are you talking? Uh, go ahead and read it. Read the note. Thank you for everything you do. The community is better place because of you, Jason. Thank, Thank you, you, Jason. Jason. The, the world is better. The reptile community is better because of you guys participating in this giveaway. We're up to 340 people. This is crazy, folks. And it's better because of the donors giving so many gifts. Oh, my I goodness. say that I'm just the Excel person. Look That's all it. I'm doing. Look, this is awesome. Thank you. Oh my gosh, can everybody see it's this? I'm going to hold it in I'm front of my face. I have to have my hat cocoa in that so now. So people can see this without a glare on it, hopefully. It's the 12 Supreme. Is it all backwards, folks? 12 Supreme Days of Christmas. You're backwards, so it could be. I won't comment on the hashtag that is. <gasps> oh, this is going to work. Don't with see me. anything. So if you didn't notice, Nanette and Wally. Nanette. Oh, you know what? I you thought, thought it, your name was on both of them. No, I thought my name was no. on both of them. My name. So I, I'm looking. I look down, folks, and I see Wally, and I look over, and it's Wally on that one. It's like, oh, I school. love I've it. Got two cups Thank and Nanette you. Has a zero. This is awesome. Thank you. I'm taking this to work the, tomorrow. I'm gonna, oh, I'm this gonna is start using cool. this. Um, I love again, it. Jason, you didn't have to do this. Thank this you. is really special. Jason is. If I'm not mistaken, oh God, cool. he's got some really nice gifts coming up. I don't want to say, although you can see it on the, the web page, but this is super that cool. That is so cool. Thank, Thank you. you I love it. Can I go get something cold to drink and forget the hot cocoa bomb and drink? Um, you no, can pour can your wait. hot cocoa bomb uh -uh. thing in here. No, no, no. No, no, okay. no, 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 no. Oh, I, I love am going it. To, I am going to share something again. I'm carrying folks. this at work tomorrow. These are super cool. Thank you very much. And I am going to jump over to, you can see everyone, day two here. Oh, we're going to talk about gifts? We're going to talk about gifts. So these are our day two. And pardon me because I'm going to look down a little bit while I read these off. But I hope everybody can see this. These are the gifts that we're going to give away um, tonight. And I'm going to talk about how we're going to give them away in just a second. But I want to read off these amazing, amazing gifts. Nanette has a list. As we pick a name, a, as we pick a name, and then that person has that gift on their list from the, I guess I'm talking about it now. <laughs> it always happens that way. So as we uh, pick a user, user, pick a participant, the top gift that's available on their list will be given to them. And then we'll move on to the next user. If they don't have any gifts, then unfortunately we'll go ahead and pick another another name out of the pool. Let's say we've picked four gifts already, and they want just isopods, but all isopods have already uh, gone. We're going to then they don't have anything left on their list, obviously. So we'll move on to the next person. And there's going to be a time eventually where we just get to a couple of gifts, probably where. We'll draw and draw and draw, and we'll, we won't have any uh, people uh, with that gift on their list. Might. I don't know. If that happens and we get we draw three or four times, we'll put it back in the pool for the next day. We don't want to be here, you know, 43 hours later trying to find, you, don't stop you know. talking. We will be. <laughs> Wally Kern from Supreme Gecko gave this, and nobody wants it. So we'll see how that goes. Uh, but let me read off these names, all the gifts, folks. Names. Uh, first okay. off, we have, hopefully you can see that. In fact, I'm going to do it like this, so you don't have to look at my face anymore. First off, we have, and this is day two, gift number one, and, and these gifts really at this point don't matter. It's just so that I can keep track of how many gifts I are out there for that, that day. Uh, Dave Visser's photography photograph, a choice of one of eight photos, 11 by 17 framed and matted, $35 value. These are super cool. We had a lot of responses last 
giveaway day that people really, really like this gift. Uh, excellent, excellent photography. And if you have, I'm going to mention real quick, I'm going to do a little promotion for Dave. If you ha He's in Wisconsin, uh, up in the Green Bay area, but if you have a pet, uh, furry pet, dog, cat, bird, um, it doesn't matter. Um, he'll set up a uh, photo shoot session with you. Oh. Yeah. Midwest Mealworms, a $20 gift certificate. I ordered Mealworms yesterday from Midwest. Uh, great company. Monday? Monday. Did I order on Monday? I don't know. Maybe. I thought you did Monday. Maybe. I'm going to come back to that. I have a note on colony and culture. I'll come right back to that. Um, number three is D&D &D Geckos, $75 gecko uh, gift certificate. I can't even read tonight. Number four, number four is Flawless Crusted Geckos, a hoodie, 60 bucks. That nice. is super cool. Well, actually, it's cool warm. Hoodie. hoodie. And if you notice, <laughs> yeah, ah, and the, uh, gift number five is from Little Potato Dragons, magnetic two cup. And you get five of these. This is a $50 value. I'm using these more and more in the facility, and I love them. I think I, I, when I started keeping crusted geckos years and years ago, um, I, I started using those big honking ledges in with the geckos. I just I really don't like those. Um, they just take up too much room, and I'm always knocking them down. These smaller uh, food holders, water holders are just, I think, just perfect. They work for me very, very well. Gift number six is from Shelby Lauren. It's Tipsy uh, Scales. It's a baby gargoyle gecko, orange reticulated, $300. Take a look at that, folks. Gift number seven is from Top Moon Lee. Top Moon Reptiles, a $250 gift certificate. I know they're doing snakes, and this would be a wonderful, wonderful gift for somebody getting into snakes. Um, the Reptile Company of Wisconsin is giving a $100 gift certificate. Again, a great company here in Wisconsin, obviously, and wonderful snakes and hognose. Oh, my gosh, we saw some hognose at the show the last time in Green Bay and just beautiful, beautiful animals. Um, they also do leopard geckos. Great company, great people. Um, and a Wisconsin, a Reptile Company of Wisconsin T-shirt, value of $20, total value is $120. Sabrina Ford, number nine. Sabrina Ford, mother of geckos, a two-pack of unrelated hashling crested geckos, three to five grams with lineage. This is a $200 value. If you have some comments, go ahead and I'm just shoot reading. them in there. There's nothing yet. Okay. You go um, ahead and finish yours. Number 10 is Jay Perkins Jr. Uh, Isopod Lovers, a $200 gift certificate. Number 11 is Richard Allen from Reptile Rapture, a new Exoterra incubator, $170 value. And number 12, Jason Cardinal from Animal House, a $200 gift certificate. Folks, six, I don't know if anybody was keeping track or remembers, that's $1,600 worth of gifts. If you see a message. Yep. You've got 327 whoops, people watching you. Outstanding. Did you just, just take lost. us out? Yeah, I did. We're back. Quit taking us I didn't out. Take a break. Um, something that I wanted to oh, mention. Don't eat yellow snow. It's not good for you. Outstanding. Uh, we need more insightful uh, tips of the day from you viewers uh, <laughs> like that. I guess for anybody that oh, has eaten yellow snow. Yeah, and let me show you my shocked face. Um, speaking of Frank. <laughs> <laughs> Speaking of Frank, lemon. you're like dark. Lemon ice. You look real dark on the camera. It's because like I got a dark, dark sweatshirt on. I'm fine. Oh, okay. Um, Speaking of Frank, Frank the Tank, I wanted to mention that we actually have four helpers tonight. We've had Frank, uh, I, I call him the, uh, the hammer of the gods because we have had some times where People have put some naughty stuff into the comments in the last live that we did. I'm not going to dwell on this too much, but Frank dropped the hammer on a couple of people mm -hmm. really super hard. Really and fast. Quick. Quick. It was like, oh, my gosh, there's a comment. I'm going to get oh, over there, and I'm going to block them gone. and remove them, and, and they're gone. They're gone. Uh, we also have um, Jacob as an admin or a um, moderator and also Andrew from DEA Exotics. And uh, as soon as I can, I'm going to add Faith as well to the, the group so that we can make sure that nothing gets through. This is, folks, 
This is a family program. Um, it was never intended ever, ever, ever to be more than that. Um, I know there's a lot of drama and I saw a show recently where it was all swearing and, and, it, and that's fine. If you want to watch that, it, just for us, we have a lot of families joining in and that's, that's outstanding. That's exactly where we want to be. Um, we want, if we have family sitting down and listening to this and enjoying the show, you know, we win. Uh, we as a reptile community win because that's our future. So that's what we're all about. We're not about drama and we're not about, you know, sensationalism. Don't do the drama. We don't do the drama. I don't do the dance. I do the dance don't once in a while. But Somebody um, said that they got no spammers today. So far, so good. That's good. G ready. Oh, we're, where's Crystal? Or maybe a GPG in the middle there. I might swear a little bit sometimes. Darn it. Yeah. Uh, talk to, why is Crystal not here in the net? Crystal's at church tonight. Doing what? Her Awana program. She's doing verses and they're practicing Christmas songs because her group is going to go Christmas caroling. What in the world is Awana? Oh, Awana is a program at church where the kids come in. They start out at three years old and they go up and they um, they learn Bible verses each week. They learn a new verse and they can award, they earn awards doing it. And they have lots of fun activities for the kids. Gym time. That's where I'm supposed to be on Wednesday nights. But I have a backup for this month. And we play in the gym. And um, they do all kinds of stuff. They hear the stories. They hear about um, the importance of God in their lives. And um, it's a good, it's a great program at our church. And it's all over the country. And our church actually just celebrated 60 years of Awana in our church. And we're not so, into preaching or no. we're not going to share religion and stuff like that here either. But, but that's um, where she's at today. Um, we, I've got a real funny story about Awana. I was in Awana when I was probably 10 or 11. Yes, it's 104 years old. Here's somebody says I was in Awana. I hey, used to do Awana. That's See, cool. people know what it is. So we, I, we went to the Awana Olympics in Chicago from Kenosha. And we, our church took a couple of buses and there were, by the time we got down there, we did the Olympics and I came out, I somehow separated from our group and um, with, you know, probably, I would say probably a hundred buses in the parking lot. I couldn't find the bus that I was supposed to get you on. You did not. Yeah, it was, it was pretty sad. It was, I, you ever, if you're ever, if you've ever been in that situation where you've been lost and the, you know, I'm not an anxiety person at all. I'm pretty, I'm pretty chill, man. Uh, most of the time. Am I chill? <laughs> Except for right now. Except for right now. I wasn't chill at that point. And I was panicking going from bus to bus. And and no, I we don't know who you are. We don't we don't know where that church is bus. And after about 10 buses or so, I came off of one and one of our group leaders grabbed me by the arm and drug me to the bus. And I couldn't have been more happy uh in a situation I don't think ever. So uh I want a great program. But anyways. What the reason I wanted to bring this up about Crystal not being in Awanas is that you are what in Awanas? I'm a leader for three-year-olds. So Nanette's so uh three-year-olds, God help you. So oh, Nanette is a, okay. a team leader for Awanas. And if you notice, obviously we have Monday, Wednesday, and Friday sessions here, live giveaways, and that includes Wednesday, Wednesdays, which is Awana night. Nanette's taken off Awanas for Four weeks. Yep, a month. Why we do this? While we do this, I have a backup. So, I'm okay. So and they'll be okay. I don't know what made you do that because I know I'm you not did. worth it. No, I'm not worth it. I'm not worth <laughs> no. that. That's no. You do. It's fun. You do. Seriously, you do a very, very good job. You know, with church and especially Awanas. Um, how long have you been doing Awanas as a leader? This is my 26th year. Twenty. God, I don't think I've ever done anything I really liked a lot for 26 years. You so. were married to me for how many years? You like I don't that. think I've ever done anything I really liked a lot for 26, 38 years. <coughs> you got it. You nailed it. And it's sometime in October. So, okay, let's get on to, um, it's early October. It's like, I don't know, the 4th or 6th or 8th. One of those. 246. 246. 246. Which one? Um, 4th. Oh, that would be your son's birthday. It's the second then. That was that was our dog's birthday. That was our dog's birthday. Uh, to, well, how? What do I have left? The sixth? Yeah. It was October sixth. You're right. right. Good yes. guess. Yes, yes, yes. All right. 
I, there's an order there somehow, and I goofed up. We're, every we're the time. last one. Two, four, six. We're, we're the, the last, last one. See, I always think the most important being the first, the second, but it's in opposite order, which I'll mess Quit up. Trying to time. figure this out and just get on with it. All right, folks. All right, folks. Here's how we're going to play. I'm going to get. I need a mouse. I prefer not to have mice in the house. Mice in the house. Mouse. Mice. In, there's mouse something in, the in my drink. Mice okay. in the house. Um. We're naming I don't know anything waffles. about Miracle Whip, peanut butter. And I don't want to okay. know the rest of that. So one. I'm going to share a screen, remove, and I'm going to share how we're going to do this, folks. Waffles is the elf's name. Oh, is that the name that we're giving? Yeah, we're going to give okay. them waffles. Why waffles? Because somebody suggested it and I like it. Cool. And I'm in charge. Okay, then. So take that. All righty. Okay. Hopefully everybody can really see this. Tired. And I'm going to jump over to the screen. So this is our automatic picker. And it, as you know, everybody that's here tonight has entered into the 12 Supreme Days of Christmas, uh, how to enter for day two. And I'm going to say real quick, if you've entered after three o'clock, I deleted you out of the, the, um, the comments. Um, but this is the way that we're going to use the picker. You listed out the gifts that you wanted in the order that you wanted them highest oh my goodness. Uh, to the lowest. This is going to be this super. This is Andrew's idea? This is Andrew's idea. Yell at Andrew. Don't yell at me. I'm not yelling at anybody yet. Um, I can't believe you thought your name was on both cups I and did. you got both I actually cups. Did. Okay. So this is the random picker. I've got the the how to enter day two here in this um, you, URL line. And I'm going to filter to include replies to comments. This is not the right number, folks. I'm going to tell you why in just a second. But I am going to do, I'm going to try to do the math. And we're going to see how many comments were out there. One, two, three. Hopefully everybody can see this. It might be small. 1219, folks. 1219. 1200 comments. So that's total. And if you oh notice, as you, um, some of you might have noticed as you put in a comment, uh, a little bit of time after I put a, a reply to your comment, either uh, thanks, good luck, or the words aren't right, you need to change this word, or you have commas after the word, something like that, so that we had every as many people as we possibly can. Now, I'm not going to be able to do this every single time, but I was able to do it for this one. So if I go back up and I um, filter duplicate users, that should take out, I could also put in, uh, I could remove uh, uh, an entry, add extra entries. Uh, I could filter out specific exclude block users. I could block Supreme Gecko. But we're just going to run this test again if I know these. You're the math major in this. I family. am not a math major by so, no means. <laughs> so we're going, this is filtering out the Supreme Gecko replies now we're down to 536 is that the number is that what you got 536 yeah so now what i'm going to do is come down one more time i want to show you this because we're trying to make this as fair to everybody um as we possibly can exclude i'm going to find no. it oh filter duplicate users okay I think now you're going to do it on the word right or the we are not going to oh. do it on the word i'm just making sure that we don't oh, have anything okay. else in here we're not going to remove the winner from the list because here's how we're going to do the can I win more than one of these gifts. We're going to do it like I had mentioned uh, in, I think, day one. You can win two gifts. And at that time, we'll uh, take your name out of the pool and we'll move on to the uh, – if we pull your name again, then we'll pull somebody else's name if you've already won twice. I hope that makes sense. Okay, did we – seven, eight, nine? I think we pulled the number. But we'll pull it again just to make sure. And see what we what get. Five. Oh, the five thirty. Five thirty six. So we have five hundred and thirty six uh, names in there, folks. I hope everybody's clear. I'm just looking at. Uh, it will faith. I just caught that. It'll only filter out the, the one time. Yeah, yeah. It won't take you out totally. If you noticed, it took me out like that. Um, Again, it's uh, uh, filter duplicate users. So I replied, you know, to everybody's comments. So it, this number should be half. I probably replied a few times to some people. Anyways, we have 536 entries. We're ready to go. So we're, again, I'm going to pick a user 
And the very first gift on that list, and you're going to have to keep track of everybody, Nanette. I got very this. first person on that list. Except for I need a pen, not a knife. You have a knife? Well, Is that... the knife from the box opening. Oh, that's not for me, personally. We're picking a winner here, folks. Here we go. What is this? This is for... Well, it's not for oh, anything. We don't know. Never we don't mind. know. See, so, I... Attica uh, Couch. Is that how you spell couch? Coach? Couch. Couch. I'm terrible, folks. Attica Couch, couch wins. You can see Mother. So, they won uh, Mother Gecko right from the bat. So, you can find Mother... We're going to take this one very slow, folks. Got it. Sabrina, Got Ford, it. Sabrina Ford, mother. Yes. Okay. And this is Attica. Attica Couch. Couch. Got is it. this making sense to everybody? I just want to make sure everybody understands this process because I'm sure nah, that doesn't work, does it? I'm sure this process is a, maybe a little different. So mother is gone. Attica has won once, and we're going to pick another winner. At literally, where it says pick another winner. Well, there you Let's go. Let's go. Hit the button. So that's Hit how simple it. this really is. This so write is, this one down. This zero is, cool. Zero, well, I can't write it. So they're no. getting. So their isopod. very first one is isopod. So again, if they had mother first, then we would go down to their isopod second lover? one. Huh? What's that? Isopod lovers? Um, isopod is isopod lovers. Okay. And that is Z E R O C O O L Ninja 88. Okay, got it. I feel like I should be going to the comments. If anybody has a well, weird, they are commenting. Yeah, if anybody has a question or any concerns or anything, you know, hopefully, I, I'm sure one of our mods will, will grab it and, and explain. Okay. This is so easy for me. I feel like I kind of feel guilty that I'm kind of taking a break in this one. Can you hit the button? I'm hitting the button. I want to see who wins. I want to see a winner. What's in the box? Pet peeds and pods. There you go, gar Rachel. Yeah. So it's a gargoyle. So the gargoyle now is off as well. So it's a uh, gargoyle. Um, oh. Can you find it? I'm looking. I'm okay. looking. Take a second. There you go. Number six. Shelby. Oh. You're Shelby, good. You're good. And that from is Tipsy. Pets. This is from Tipsy. What's that? Pets and Peds one. Yep. Pet Peds and Pods. Pet Peds, Peds and, and Pods. Pods. Rachel. Congratulations, Rachel. Tipsy Scales. This is from Tipsy Scales. Baby Gargoyle Orange Retic. All right. Okay. So we have <laughs> how many off the board? Three. Three. Okay. Let's go again. <laughs> And the winner is Ooh, now we got Garg again. Beckler. So Gargoyle <clears throat> is off. So, so they don't get the Gargoyle. He gets Animal House. Right? They get Animal, or they get Animal House. I'm sorry, Animal Milo House. Beckler. Cool. So as an example, we had a couple of people putting Animal House. We <clears throat> had a couple of people put the full word Gargoyle. I just put a reply in there their, in a comment saying, that you have to change it. So oh, they had they to be like it. your words? They had to be like our okay. words. Now, See, I don't know any of this stuff until I'm here. You tell me nothing. That's because I'm just as confused as you are. Uh, seriously, for this one, it really didn't matter too much. If they put Gargoyle, we would have known, certainly. But I really, really, really want to stay with the rules simply because in our one of our pickers, like we did Monday, it has to be specific. It has to be exact. Okay. okay. Next so one. Am I saying that too much? Am I being no, too you're much fine. of a jerk with you're that? You're being okay. Okay. So Taylor oh, wins. Congratulations, Taylor. So here's what we have. Isopods is gone. Isopods is gone. So Taylor, you don't get isopods. But she gets the top moon. Yes. I'll give certificate. Taylor. Or he. I'm sorry. I was going to say, how do you know if that's a... Well, it could be a he or she. I'm terrible. And I'm just if, used to the if we Taylor. You... I've, we've got three Taylors in my, my class at school. So, and they're all girls. So, I'm just So, when I saw that, she. I saw Tyler right away. I don't, oh, good I Lord. don't know why. Okay, let's go ahead. Read. So, we have how many off the list right now? Five. Okay, so let We're me know, folks. Is your one. top gift still on the list? Is it still there? Let's do another one. Zeno. Now, I okay. recognize this name from before. Okay, let me just go through the list. Gargoyle is her first one. That's gone, right? Right. Okay. 
D and D is their next one, and that's not gone. So that's I not gone. So they get D and D. D and D geckos, and what did they give? They gave a seventy-five dollar gift certificate. Cool. And that stole my list, so I can't tell I you exactly. Next to the list, there's two copies. Are there? I'm gonna. I'm just gonna pretend like you stole it because I don't want to dig it out. Okay. So how many? We've got seven out of or six. We have That's six. Sixth one. one, two, three. So four, who do we five, still six. have left? Just real. We quick have enough. Dave Visser's photography um, gift. We have Midwest Mealworms. Flawless is still out there for the hoodie. Little Potato Dragons is out there still, and Reptile Company of Wisconsin's out there, and Reptile Rapture. Wow. There's still wow. a lot of good prizes. I, I like that incubator. I saw that earlier. You can't win. I can't win. If I can't win, you can't Can win. I win the hoodie? No, you can't win if I can't Son win. Son of a... And if you got the hoodie, it'd be mine anyway. Okay. Christian L. So we start with Top Moon. Top Moon is their first one. Is gone. Top Moon available? It's gone. Top Moon is gone. Gargoyle. Gone. Isopod. Gone. Mother. Gone. House. Gone. Oh, my goodness. Incubate. So I'm going to tell you right now, if if Christian L. stopped at house, they would be done. They would be done. We'd pick another name. Their next one, though, he is got the incubator. incubator. Okay, I need I the name. Everybody can see that. I Whoa. made that real small. I apologize, folks. So it is Christian L. And um, sorry, Nanette. You're fine. Incubator. Got the incubator. Okay, so we have seven off the board, right? The new exoteria. Yep. Incubators. Okay. It says. So. Exoteria okay. incubator from Richard from uh, Reptile Rapture. Okay. Do this. Why does it jump me down like that all the time? Molly Orman. Okay. Okay. House. Gone. Wisconsin. Available. Outstanding. So what is that gift again? Let's that read it That is the Reptile Company of Wisconsin, along with Reptile Company of Wisconsin T-shirt, hundred or $100 gift certificate, and then a $20 T-shirt. Molly nice. Orman. Cool. I'm just kind of looking at this. Now, right now, time. what's left is yeah, Little ahead. Potatoes, Dragons, Flawless, Midwest Mealworms, and... The photography from Dave. Cool, cool. Make another winner. Survey says Sloth Gamer Plays. Sloth Gamer Plays. Oh, my goodness. Top Moon, Garg. Okay, wait, wait, wait. wait. Top, yep. Moon's Top Moon, gone. gone. Garg, Garg is gone. Isopods, gone. Mother, gone. House, gone. Flawless. <gasps> not gone. Not All gone. Right. Flawless Sloth. is not gone. You just got yourself a cool sweatshirt. Flawless is gone in 60 seconds. Another movie. Where, come on, Wally. I don't know what I'm going to do yeah, with you. I don't know. I don't know. Everybody can still see this. Cool. So right now Again, what you have slot. left is mealworms and the picture. Is that it? Really? We're already? Right. One, two. Oh, and potato dragons okay so three left I'll, i guess i'll yep, have to keep three. track of how many are left three left folks really i'm getting that look really 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 calvin mathis <clears throat> excuse me gargoyle gone mother gone incubator gone house gone top moon gone isopods gone cups that's the little dragons right it is Little All potato right. dragons. Now it's little gone. potato dragons. It's not supreme. It's supreme gecko. It's little potato dragons. dragons. Okay. So now <clears> it's <throat> U.S. mealworms me. and Dave. Mealworms and Dave. Picture. I'm really surprised. I have to say real quick here. I'm really surprised that we haven't hit a, a gift. These are all outstanding gifts, but like I'm sure some people don't keep isopods, so they wouldn't have isopods on the list, obviously. So if we picked. You know, um, if we go down, if isopods were, you know, uh, left over, and I'm surprised we wouldn't go through something like that two or three times. But anyways, let's go ahead and pick another winner. Does that make any sense go at ahead. all? No. no that's what... You have to sing this name, Nanette. Do, re, mi, gan. Do, re, mi, gan. Do, a deer. I don't sing. Okay. So, gargoyles. You want a live show, right? I sing. You're gonna lose and that 300 people. 43 hey, people. Everybody will be gone. Okay. Dore Megan has gargoyles. Gone. Mother. Gone. Isopod. Gone. Incubator. Isopods. Cups. 
Gone. D and D. Gone. Wisconsin. Gone. Wisconsin is gone. Yeah, we just pulled Wisconsin, right? Yeah. So okay. Now what? So everything on their list. Unfortunately, is gone. do re mi, Megan. I'm sorry, do re Megan is gone. So we're going to go ahead and Guard, jump to the mother, next. Incubator, yep. isopod cups, D and D. Yep. Everything yep, is yep, gone. Yep. What's left? Still, I'm sorry, Dave. The meal the and, and the, the meal Gotcha, gotcha. So we need Dave. We need photo and mealworm. Photo and mealworm. Help me, Nanette. Mother, gargoyle, incubator, isopods, D and D cups. Photo. Photo. Hannah. Hannah. Whoop. Hannah. Kranzish. Hannah. Kranzush. 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 Hannah. Sorry. Kranzush. It's not your name. It's me. Yeah. Well, the it's fault me is in me. <clears throat> okay. All right. So now you have the mealworm. I need left. coffee. I'm, I'm choking here. I'm dying. I'm dying here, folks. Do you have anything okay. left in your can? Yeah, I do. Oh, I'm, well, drink I'm your soda kidding. then. Okay, death is only natural house. I, so what are we looking for? We're looking for mealworms. We're looking for mealworm and it's on the bottom. There you go. So. Oh, wait, wait. Yeah, wait, yeah, yeah. I'm I sorry. The name death is only natural. I wrote mealworm instead. Death is only natural. <laughs> So I'm going to jump back okay. over here. So one, two, three, four. I want you first. That was interesting, Andrew. Andrew, you know, we talked about this back and forth. You came you came across with this idea, and I was thinking of it incorrectly, obviously, that we would pick a gift and then try to match up the name. You were just saying, let's just pick a name and then give away the gifts in that order. And it's like, wait, if we do that, oh, yeah, yes, that would work. So we had a couple of concerns that the big gifts would go quicker, and then we would have smaller gifts. I don't think that was a case at all. No, we had I think it was... you know gifts all over the place. I think this was a phenomenal way of doing this this drawing. And don't be surprised, folks, if this comes back this way of doing it uh, again in the giveaway. Now I like to mix this up. I don't like anything to be predictable in this giveaway, if you know what I mean. So we might do something completely like different it. tomorrow. We will do something completely different tomorrow. And tomorrow we aren't doing anything. Tomorrow, day I'm three. I'm taking a test tomorrow. We will do something different for day three. I'll announce in the how to enter day three video tomorrow that will come out tomorrow, how to enter day three. <clears throat> and it will be different from something that we've done for day one or day two. They like it. I like it. Excellent. Excellent. Um. I was going to mention something. So, no, Frank, I'm not really good at it. Congratulations. What are you not good at? Tests. Tests. I'm not good at math, period, Frank. I I don't know about you folks, but when I was in school, I, I think this was high school and college, I don't know if I was smart. Um, I don't think I was smart at all. I think I was a great test taker. I think I was exceptional at taking tests. And that's simply because I wanted to beat the system as much as I possibly could. And I was super lazy. I had social studies as my last class as a senior in high school, and I literally slept through every class. And the teacher at near the end of the semester asked the other students around me, you know, if I had a, a problem uh, because I was sleeping all the time. I'd come into the class, I'd put my book down, I'd open it up, and I'd, I would doze and, okay, everybody, thanks for coming, and I was gone. And but what I would do before the tests was open the book and just crush it for about a half hour. And I got a, I think I got an A in that class um, because I knew how to take tests so well. Um, and I, I feel for people that don't have that skill, I, I wish I could teach a couple of things to people. But um, speaking of I math and Jeanette, other socks or other that? tests, I can take other oh, tests. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Um, but Math doesn't come easy for some people, and I know it's not something that comes easy to you either, Nanette, and I appreciate that because I tell you what, folks, at 11.30, almost 12 o'clock, I've, if I've gotten to a point where I'm finished with a task, you know, I've got a list of different things that I have to do, and if I come to the end of one of them, and I, I, I usually don't want to start another one that late, it's like, Nanette, I've got to go to bed. We do, we do. She does the studying and, and homework and quizzes here, and I work on the computer on things. And about 11.30, it's like, hey, I've got to go to bed. I'm, I'm done for the night. And as you as, if you saw Nanette's post, she was up until 12.30? 12.28, I finished. 12.28, and that's not 
not uncommon at all. So, you know, again, I give you props for being able to stick with this. And I know it's not your funnest thing to do in the world. And you have 150 other things that you have to cram into your mm -hmm. life. But um, we'll get there. Way One more go. week. Next a week. From Hats Thursday. off to Nanette. Well, I'm not going to take my no, hat take off. Your hat I'm not going to go that far. Math is easy. We'll math is that. not easy. Math is easy. I I like math too, and it kind of comes easy, easier for me um, as well. But I know it's a struggle for other people. Uh, grammar is a struggle for me. Mm -hmm. So, okay, we've got a couple people right. that have commented that they really, really like this. But we've yeah. had a couple people that said, "What happened to the person that got their name pulled but gets nothing?" Yeah, How that's do unfortunate. That? Coco Bob. Uh, We'll have to think about that. Yeah, think about that. How we I do feel that. bad because they didn't win something. Um, it, it's going to happen. They chose what they wanted. I think that we were very fortunate tonight, though, that we only had one person instead of having, you know, many at the very end that maybe only had three. I know a lot of people said, I, I messaged people. I put comments and said, hey, you only have one gift entered or you only have two or three gifts. I just want to make sure you understood the rules and you can enter up to 12 if you want. And every one of them said, no, I don't need the other gifts. These are the ones that I want. And uh, it's like. Wow. Somebody's saying put their name to the side and wait until the end of the, the event. And if there's something unclaimed, let them choose from an unclaimed gift. Do it. Um, Do you have Doray Me? Do Do Ray, Ray, I was going to say, who was it? Megan. Do Ray, Megan. We will do that. Whoever said that, uh, you Great get 10 idea. points tonight. You are the leader in, in points tonight. Although, who was the first one that said Elf on a Shelf? They, oh, they somebody way points. back at the very beginning of this okay. thing. Give me 10 minutes. I'm going to find that name. 10 minutes. It's going to take you three hours. Are we going to give Cocoa Bombs out ever? You never put it on the list. I don't have it on my list. Why not? Okay. Maybe we'll add it to I I have a whole list of the gifts. I can't just add and subtract stuff like this. Cocoa you Bombs, you think can put I, in. I'm not that flexible. My, my lists are my lists, and they're done when they're done. Um, I might have to your spreadsheet. I'll add them. Maybe not next show, but the show after. Maybe, maybe we'll see. We'll do some cocoa bombs, folks. We're going to do cocoa bombs in this in the live giveaway. Now we didn't do a live giveaway. Now we didn't have a live donor video because we wanted to kind of see how we could streamline this show specifically uh, for everybody, and especially for Nanette because she has. A, I almost swore she has a lot of homework. Um, to do I tonight. got till midnight. I'm yeah, good. I know you do, but I, I don't feel good about that. Anyways, so I wanted to congrat. I wanted to. My dentures are slipping again. I wanted to congratulate the winners. Thank you very much, everyone, for uh, entering. You guys did a great job with the words. Um, winners, hey winners, message me on Facebook. Let me know that you won. I go through a process, and everybody seems to be comfortable with this. I go through a process where if you send me a message on Facebook. You might be Do Ray Megan here, but you might be Wally Kern. Would I do Do Ray Megan? Maybe I wouldn't do Do Ray Megan ID on YouTube, but you might be a different name on Facebook. I don't know that, so I need to match you up. So what I do is I ask for a secret word for you to post a comment on this live stream, and then I go over to the comment, and I see your user profile, and I match it up, and it's the same, so then we work out the the details of hooking you up with the donors uh, of the gifts that you've won. So it's a little more lengthy than it probably should be, but it absolutely guarantees that we don't give away a thousand dollar gift certificate to somebody uh, that I don't give away a major gift to somebody um, that jumps in as kind of a spam person. So thank you for tolerating that, that um, verification process. Uh, my 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 thing is right. So what's here. different in the room tonight? What did you add? I added the the elf on the shelf. I'm just verifying so everybody heard it. Yeah. We have an elf on the shelf who's we being naughty right now. He laid down. I thought that that's what elves do. No, the elf on the shelf is a naughty elf. He's supposed to do I need things. The... But we're not going to have a naughty elf. Why can't we have a naughty elf? Okay, I'm because hide. Diet Pepsi. And I am going way to over any of the other ones. Do this. Frank. Bear with me, folks. Remove. Who I'm going to show you real quick. Who did you remove? I'm going to I remove. Thought you deleted me. Stop sharing. <laughs> Go to share screen. 
you know, I don't know when people do this, you know, um, just like blindly and it works for them. It, it's so amazing to see things like this happen um, from YouTubers that are really, really good with this kind of stuff. If you noticed, who noticed that I had already loaded day three? Leave a comment in the, the comments. Say, I saw it or say yes or something. I was thinking kind of about curious that with the way technology watching you bounce across all this. Uh, bad elf, bad elf. I was just thinking how, you know, 10 years ago, we didn't do this kind of thing. You didn't have the opportunity to do this. What did we do? We we said, okay, the next gift is, and I have the 12 names of people that that put in. Let me pull one of the names. Um, I would say even, you know, la even to last year, we were picking out of maybe 100 names out of a hat, right? But even having the technology to do this stuff. Oh, what oh, I, I what learned from Crystal after being in COVID and shut down in schools and how to use the computer and do all this stuff is amazing to me. When Crystal was, she had to be two, I think. And I was, you know, still working. I had my laptop open. You're still working now. I don't work anymore. I, oh. I sleep until noon and then I watch yeah, the right. Flintstones and the yeah. Jeffersons uh -huh. uh, or the Jetsons. Flintstones, Jetsons. And then I watch um, SpongeBob. I've never watched an episode of SpongeBob in my life. Um, not that it's a bad show. I just have never seen it. But anyways, um, I don't do anything all day. Yeah, right. Anyways, so let's get back to old. technology is fantastic. Uh, a lot of people saw this already. You cheaters, you. You guys are cheating. You shouldn't look at day three before I post it, Um, before I talk about it. So day three has some amazing. Go ahead. Just, just take them off right out. away from me because I'm reading off. So day three has. You got it? What did you say? Oops. Can I hide the Colony comment? Colony Culture put a, a comment about reminding people where to go to find things. There you go. Thank you. So again, this <clears> is the 12 Supreme Days of Christmas. He's got. The link right there. Mm -hmm. He's got everything in there for you. Um, so here's our gifts. Uh, gift number one. And again, this isn't in, yeah, it's kind of in an order of highest to lowest, but really every single value and every single gift here, folks, is so precious. Um, from Crystal, Tailspin Geckos, it's a baby gargoyle with parent uh, photos, lineage, $375 value from Ryan and Erica McVeigh, VivTech. It's a VivTech. It's got to be good. A set of VivTech products, Sun, Sir Sun bulbs valued at $250. Art will be included as existing extras from Auntie Arts Creation. I wonder who Auntie Arts Creations is. So I tried to get from Erica. What's the value? I think in 48 messages. I hope she's watching. I think in 48 <laughs> messages. So how much? What should I put for the value of the art? And then should go off and. Uh, uh, here's what I, we're giving from VivTech. Here's a link to VivTech. Here's a picture. Is what's the art worth? What should I put down for? Never got it. So I'm not sure how what the value is, but it's it's a lot. It's like thousands of dollars of value. But anyways, <laughs> from VivTech, we have the set of VivTech products, uh, Sir Sun Bulbs and Art. Uh, gift number three is from Doug Cooley, Ridiculous Rax. If you know Rax, if you know Lichis, um Lichianus, I think Doug is one of the top Top breeders, top two, top three. I wouldn't go any further than three. Lichianus breeders in the U.S. that I know of. Anybody have thoughts Keep on going. that? $200 gift certificate. Gift number four from Matt is from uh, Lizard Wizard Reptiles, $150 gift certificate. Matt's doing some pretty cool stuff with Krusty Geckos, folks. Gift number five. We're getting up there. Joe Hop, oh. Hop's Geckos, $150 gift certificate. I want that. No. Gift number, Joe has some of the rarest geckos. No. Joe is kind of like my, my. he's at the top of my list, I tell you. Um, Denise Flagg, uh, D&D geckos, again, again with a gift. $75 gift certificate. Uh, Will and Miss Audra from Flawless Crested Geckos it, it has donated another hoodie. Again, folks, you see a pattern coming here. These, these folks have donated every single day. It's just incredible. Leanna? From Little Potato Dragons, uh, one cup 3D printed magnetic ledge. There's seven of them, a $30 value. Gift number nine. We keep going and going. Ken has, from oh. Western Village of Payson, Arizona. We might have a video of Ken in tomorrow's uh, How to How to Enter Day number three. Oh, okay. Oh, yeah. Okay. So tomorrow uh, I'm coming out with a video. video. Yeah. Yep. 
and uh, how Azur, Azur, Azurite, Azurite, and copper heart pendant. That's a pretty cool pendant, folks. And he's he knows his jewelry. So, okay, gift number 10 is the Bug Hub, and it's a $50 gift certificate. Really cool uh, isopods there, some of the nicer ones around. Robert Dufek from uh, Exotic Cure LLC, and I've got a special announcement. I can't say it today, but I will in the uh, video tomorrow or our live stream Friday. $50 gift certificate, some really cool substrates, uh, different kinds of uh, cocoa blocks and things like that. Gift number 12, Melanie from Bertopia Geckos, a $50 gift certificate. Really nice. Boy, she's been posting some uh, pictures of her crusted geckos on Facebook. And I think after 20 years, I, I, I feel like I've seen a lot. And, and some of her geckos really turn my head. They really mm. do. Gift number 13. 13? Look at this. Look at this. We keep Holy going. Yeah, God. we were at 12. Now we're at 13. Wow. Uh, Dale from DVD Pet uh, it has given us an Exoterra 100-watt thermostat, $40, $43. Folks, if you don't have thermostats running your heat mats or your flex and your heat tape, um, you're making a mistake. Now, I've done it. I did it for many, many years. And if anybody remembers, a couple months ago, I posted a picture of some heat tape that burnt out, that just ruined. I don't know how we didn't have a fire down there. Thank God we didn't. That week, I put some different thermostats on all of my all of my racks that needed them. Gift number 14, again from Dave. 11 by 17 framed matted winner's choice of these eight pictures. Uh, $35 value. Gift number 15 from, uh, from Paul's Pills. Um, 12 count of... Question mark roaches. If you've seen these in, in person, folks, they're pretty cool. 12 count, $30 value. Gift number question 16. Mark. Where's a question mark? Question mark roaches. They have that's a little, the name of them? That's the name of them. Oh. They have a little question mark on their backs. Oh, okay. Yeah. I thought you there's, were saying it was a question mark. There's question mark, mark uh, roaches. There's ampersand. There's tilde roaches. There's, I'm just kidding. I'm trying to think of some of the more. Just move on. All right. Move on. Gift number 16 from uh, Justin at Midwest Mealworms is another $20 gift certificate. Oh, my gosh. There's more. Should we just quit? I'm tired. Gift number 17 from Veronica from VB Creations is a oh, panda cool. king mutt. Thank you, Veronica. That's, That's really cool. Last and certainly least is Wally and Annette. Well, at least Wally. Yeah, I didn't participate in that. From Supreme Gecko, Supreme Isopod Chow Combo Pack for $15. Let me go back over here so people can see us again. So, again, tomorrow, uh, sometime hopefully before noon. I say that, but it's going to be like 1 or 2 in the afternoon probably. I'm going to put out that video on how to enter for day 3. Watch it. Follow the instructions exactly as I say to make sure that you're entered correctly for day three. We'll, go, we'll come back again. We'll come back for day three's giveaway. Everybody say it with me. Friday, 730 p.m. Central Time. Friday. And the video on how to enter comes out tomorrow. Tomorrow. So that you can put your entries in in preparation for Friday's video. What else do you have, Nanette? Anything? Thank you again for our awesome mugs Yay. or cups. These are just phenomenal. So, so, so These appreciated. These are so cool. Thank, Thank you. Thank you very much. Thank you for the comments. I wish I could read every single one. It's just, it's becoming impossible, just impossible. So I'm going to read these comments, though, after the show. Maybe not tonight, but probably tomorrow yeah, will, morning before be I do the midnight video. Tonight. Yeah, Watch that's it. probably true. And I'm going to take some of the comments about movie scenes or songs or something in a maybe a gecko sense or maybe i just do them as as they they are in the movies what's in the box um and i'm going to add that to the how to enter maybe not tomorrow but in future videos i think they're a lot of you fun still hopefully have over you do 200 too. people listening to you ramble 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 <laughs> wah, 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 wah. Wah, wah. that sounds like charlie brown's teacher wah, 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 wah. thank you everyone for joining us tonight watch the video tomorrow we'll see you see friday, you friday. Good night, all.